it's Lexi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to customize your phone using the new iOS 14 update, which is so exciting. So all timestamps will be in the description down below. If you like the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe and go check out my Instagram, which will be right over here. And let's go ahead and get straight into the video. Okay guys, so the first thing I'm going to show you guys how to do is how to install iOS 14 if you don't have it. So to install iOS 14, all you have to do is go to settings and then go to general and software update. And it's going to say checking for update. And then once it's checked for the update, it will say install and you can just install it from there. I've already installed it, so that's why it's not going to give me an update, but you can just install it from here. The next thing you must do is choose your color palette or your aesthetic. So decide if you want maybe like um, boho or if you want TikTok style, which is definitely more my style, or what type of aesthetic do you want? So I'm just gonna put a bunch of images over here on Pinterest and you can just go through and decide what palette you want and then we can get started. How to create aesthetic widgets. Okay guys, so to do the aesthetic widgets, you have to download an app called Widgetsmith. So just go to App Store and this is it right here. I've already installed it, so you can just click open. And then what you have to do is this is the page you'll be greeted with. So you can create a large, medium and small widgets. So I've already created two small ones, which are the ones you see right here on the front screen. So we can just go back into Widgetsmith and then just click add small widget. And then you can just click on the Sunday 20th, which is the date and yeah, and the weekday. So then what you can do is you can choose if you want to do reminders, temperature, although you have to pay for the temperature, month and date, um, the time. So you can do clocks. But what I did is I went to photo in album. And what you have to do here is you have to create a specific album for your photo. So I'm sorry if I can't explain that well, but you choose your images from Pinterest and place it in one folder with one image. Otherwise the images will keep switching. So just scroll down to which folder you want. So I'm just gonna go with the LOL folder and click save. And then it's like that on your home screen, but to actually add it to your home screen, you have to hold down with your thumb, click the plus button, go to Widgetsmith, and then click small widget, right like that. But I've made three, so you have to hold on to it, I edit widget, and then click small four, which is the new one that we've just made. So there we go. How to do aesthetic app logos, and I'm really sorry about any background noise in this clip. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys how to do the customized app logos. So to do that, you're going to need an app called Shortcuts. Now, this is normally installed on everyone's phone, but if you delete the app, then you can just install it from the app store again. So, yeah. Okay, so what you have to do is just go to all shortcuts, then click the plus button, add action, and then just choose scripting, open app, choose. And then you just choose an app. Let's just do YouTube, for example. Click, click the three dots and then you can name it. So let's just name it YouTube. You can click here and you can choose the color and like all of that. If you don't want to change the image yet, click add to home screen. And then here, this is where you can change the image. So let's say we wanted to do like a indie style i really like this photo click choose click add and then it will be added to your home screen like that and then you just do that for all of your apps and it will look so cute and aesthetic thank you guys so much for watching this video i really hope you guys enjoyed i'm not the best at explaining i really hope that i could explain it to you well enough so that you understand what to do um just have fun with it like it's honestly so fun um please subscribe if you enjoyed and give this video a big thumbs up I love you guys all so much and I'll see you guys in my next video.